Hey guys, how's it going? This is Matthew Briggs here at Beagle's Nest Studio in lovely New Braunfels, Texas. I want to talk to you today about the bass guitar. You got a brand new bass and you're ready to rock out with everybody, but nothing sounds right. I want to talk to you today about tuning this thing. This thing is a little different than a guitar. Instead of having six strings, it has four. Very similar to the top notes of the strings on the guitar. You have E, A, D, G. E, A, D, and G. So as we get ready to tune this, we reach for our tuner. This right here is a clip-on tuner. And the way it works is when you hit a note, the note travels sound through the neck of the guitar all the way to the top of the headstock. When it gets to the headstock, this computer reads it. It tells you whether or not you want to go up in pitch or down in pitch. Okay, so up in pitch is sharp, down in pitch is flat. This thing has a gas gauge on it. You can kind of see it. The way that this reads is if it's this way, it's low on gas. If it's this way, it's too much. We want to go straight up and down. And when we get to the note that we want, it'll light up. If we do the top one first, it'll say E. It'll light up E and it'll, it'll, it'll be green. Green means you're good. Okay? So let's try tuning one up. Clip it on here. Uh, right now the setting says G. I don't want G. I don't want B for violin. I don't want U for ukulele. C is chromatic. Chromatic means is that you can tune any, any fret up and down this bass. You can tune the G, the A, anywhere you want to land. But we're going to go ahead and put it on B for bass. We, this thing defaults for B for bass, giving you the E, A, D, and G strings. Okay? I'm going to put this right on my lap. I'm going to take my finger here, and I'm just going to pluck the top string. As I pluck the top string, I can tell that I need to give it a little bit more up in pitch. So I'm going to turn it counterclockwise to go up. And as soon as I do, I can spin it just enough for me to get the green. Well, now we're just going to go to the next next string. We got E, next one is A. It needs to come up, so I'm going to go ahead and just turn it counterclockwise to spin it up. I got a green A, so I'm going to go to the next one. Oh, it needs to come up as well, so I'm turning it counterclockwise really slow. I'm making slow movements with my left hand, and I'm barely hitting my right hand to where the computer has time to recognize the noise. You wouldn't want to get on here and just try to find the note. You just want to hit it, barely turn it, so you get the green. All right, got green for D. All right, now that I'm on my last one over here, I can tell that I'm high. I'm a little above the note, which means I'm sharp. I need to bring it down. Now I'm going to turn the tuner peg counterclockwise. All right. Now that I have all notes in tune, I should be able to plug this into an amp and play along with all my friends as we're jamming out. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe, come back and see me again. If there's any more questions that you guys have, please comment uh, down below and let me know. I'll, I'll send you a video or help out any way I can. All right, see you next time.